Hey guys, I'm back with my Yophone X. This is a sample of the front camera and the rear camera in daylight. Now, in my last video, the one that I took last night, I did it at night time and the results were pretty poor. But that is to be expected. That is what you do see in most budget and even up to mid-range Android phones. Now, a couple of times, um, the audio kind of went away and the reason is... They've put the mic in what I consider to be a very silly position. They've got one down the bottom, but they don't have any other mic. So sometimes if you're holding the phone in the wrong way, you cover the microphone. But um, there's one other thing I have to note is, you know, I didn't notice this until the end of the videos yesterday. There's two smudges. There's one there and there's one up there. Now, obviously that's annoying. It seems to be a, a, a problem with my phone. It seems to be a mark underneath the actual glass. It's nothing to do with software. I think it's just a smudge. I don't think it's a scratch. But I bought my uh, the Uophone X. I bought it from Banggood and I've let them know. So they've got in touch with me and I've sent my video showing them what it is. So try and disregard that because what I'm trying to show you is what the quality of the phone is like for every Uophone X, not just mine. Mine might have two little smudges and it is bad to see that in a phone when you buy it. But hopefully you will be able to see the quality of the phone and again listen to the the, um, the audio as well uh, i'm not going to put any music over it i'm not going to use an external microphone i'm just using it with my hand so you know if it's jumpy it's because well that's what you would see with the phone so i'm going to take a walk over to my parents house and along the way uh, i'm going to take some um some videos and i'll show you the rear camera and i'll show you the front camera when we're in good light So pay attention to the focus, which sometimes goes a, kind of goes a little bit of a ray. Also pay attention to the stabilization or the lack of it. Hey guys, so I'm using the front camera of the Uphone X here and you saw from the rear camera that in daytime, you know, when you've got a lot of light, I don't think this is actually too bad. At the front here I've got a 13 megapixel sensor, at the back is 16 and 5 dual cameras and you know it's the same story at night time as you saw in the last video. With budget phones it's always a camera, you know this is always an area that they kind of skip over and they save some money on and at night time you know it's always pretty bad as far as the performance goes and you saw that last night in the, in the night time sample you saw that you know the lights were bright and you couldn't focus on anything focusing is a lot better in the, in the daytime um stabilization seems a little bit better as well but overall i think for a budget phone for a phone that i paid less than 120 pounds for i think the front camera is okay i think the the back camera is okay for daytime I think the mics are okay as long as you don't cover the mic. Um, I think the microphones aren't too bad actually for a budget phone. But over to you guys. Let me know what you think. Leave a comment below and let me know what you think about this. Please do check out the, um, the nighttime sample as well to see what the performance of the front camera and the rear cameras are like at nighttime. But um, apart from that, guys, let me know what you think. Leave a comment and stay tuned because I will be doing another video soon where I show you how the phone actually performs and tell you what I like and what I don't like about the Uphone X. Thanks for watching, guys. Till next time. Take care.